In this video, I'm going to show you how to take the Desmos graphing calculator and make it into a number line. So I like to have a nice, neat number line for my students, and they're hard to find online. So if I go to Desmos graphing, I can click on the wrench over here. And then in my other video, I show you how to make it count by ones. Um, and this is going to be similar. So what I want to do is I want to get rid of the minor grid lines. I actually want to get rid of all the grid lines. I'm going to add arrows to the end. I want it to be a number line. So that's just the X axis. So I'm going to uncheck the Y axis, and then I would like for it to count by ones. So I'm going to have it count by ones. So if I click off, you can see that I have my number line. So how do I get it from here? So if you come up here and click on the share graph, one of your options is to export the image, and then you can pick the size. So based on the size you pick is how it counts. I typically use a large square or a large rectangle. The square is my favorite. And then I like the lines to be thick so my students can see it. So I typically make it thick and then click download PNG. And then you're able to put this image into a worksheet or a classwork activity. And you have a nice looking number line for your students to use.